Hello everyone! Today we will be showing you how to use the Timetable Builder. Whether you're looking to plan your courses or want to take a course at another UFT campus, the Timetable Builder can help you find courses that are offered at UFT to help you plan your weekly schedule for your upcoming year. Let me show you how it works. How does the Timetable Builder work? Step one, search for courses. First, select your faculty or division and the session you want to study. For example, if I create my own schedule, I would select my faculty or division as University of Toronto, Mississauga, and the session, for example, summer, fall, or winter. Step two, add more filters. You can search by course code, course title, or keywords or select the department or subject area you wish to study. Step three, show more filters. To get even more specific, click on show more filters to refine your search. Here you'll see the option to choose distribution requirements, instructors, course level, delivery mode, time preference, campus, and credit weight. Using the waitlist and availability option, the Timetable Builder can show you to courses with available spots and those with waiting list options. Let me show you how I use the Timetable Builder and search for a course together. I'm going to search for SOCH 100, Intro to Sociology. When searching, I can see the course details such as day, time, location, instructor, availability, waitlist, enrollment controls, and delivery mode. Now I'm ready to add the course to my planner. I'll choose add to timetable and the timetable builder will show you a weekly calendar view of all the courses you wish to take. If I choose lock to timetable, the feature will lock your course into your course plan and highlight it in green that you can use when there might be a program requirement or elective course you are certain you want to take. Next, I will add a few more courses to our schedule. Here's something really important. If you click on enrollment controls, a drop-down description will explain which group of students have priority access to enroll in the course. If you are not in the priority group, you should check to see if and when the course becomes available to you. Make note of the date and time in your personal calendar and you can try again on that date. If there is a restriction, that means only a particular group of students can take that course. Course conflict. As I add courses, we see that there might be a conflict between two courses. If I try to add a course that might be happening on the same day and time, both courses are highlighted in red. If you need to take both courses, check to see if one of the courses is offered at a different time, day, or session. Unfortunately, if it is not, you will have to pick one course and take the other the next time it is offered. Benefits of the Timetable Builder Block Off Time Feature You can use the Block Off Time Feature to prevent the system from adding a course to your schedule during a time that you have other commitments like a part-time job, clubs, volunteering, or personal appointments. This can help prevent conflicts between school, work, and life. You can also click on any time slot and follow the same process from there to block off any time you need. Once you are happy with your timetable, you can export it as a PDF or PNG file, print the timetable, and even get a shareable link that you can send to friends. The Timetable Builder is just a planning tool. It does not enroll you into them. 
When the course enrollment start time begins, log on to Acorn to officially enroll into them. The Timetable Builder is built for you. Visit ttb.utoronto.ca to create your timetable now. If you have any questions or issues about the Timetable Builder, connect with us at the Office of the Registrar. Thank you for listening.